Daniel is here with my trailer reaction and review for Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. James Gunn just dropped a new trailer. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy, the first Guardians of the Galaxy is a movie that is one of my favorite Marvel movies. I don't watch it as much as the other ones, say Winter Soldier, Civil War, or The Avengers, but every time I do watch the film, I do find a lot more of a, pre a, pre a, lot more of a pre appreciation for it. It is a very good film, and with the humor and the characters and what James Gunn was able to do with it, bringing these obscure characters to life was magnificent. And I'm really looking forward to Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. It takes place three months after the first film. It has Kurt Russell in it. It has Mantis in it. We're finally getting to see Mantis come to life in the MCU. And it also, um, it also has Ego the Living Planet. I mean, Eagle Liv the Living Planet. Who thought we would ever see Eagle the Living Planet in a, um, in a, in a film? Not even a Marvel film, just in a film in general. So um, all this is very exciting. It's going to be nice to see all these a-holes um, united unite together again. So let's take a look at this trailer and see what James Gunn has brought us. Game James Gunn and Marvel Studios has brought us today. The fate of the universe lies on your shoulders. Well, oh, that's a hell of a way to start it. Now whatever you do, <laughs> don't push this button. Set off the bomb immediately, and we'll all be dead. This gun sound, this rocket sound, a little no, different. No, no, that's the button that will kill everyone. Try again. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. No. <laughs> oh, cool. in it it's very vibrant i love the aesthetic of it all um there there's not really james gunn said that he's not going to give them away a, a lot in these trailers in the marketing for guardians of the galaxy 2 and it really didn't we didn't see we didn't see any of ego the living planet we saw enough of manta to understand that she's a new character maybe not that she's a part of the guardians of the galaxy team and i don't know if she will be but um she's not a part of the team per se but she is in the movie got to be a new character you get to catch up with everybody else. They show a lot of Baby Groot, which looks really cool. I like how he's using his tentacles to throw the guy off the bridge. That looks great. You get to see a lot more bantering and arguing between this team. Um, the, you know, the, <laughs> like, you have an atomic bomb in your back, Pat. You should have tape. That, that was a great interaction as well. I mean, overall, this is, I mean, this is what we're expecting from this. More humor, more heart. Everything that... Everything from the last film that worked just expanded a little bit more. And of course, there's going to be new things like, you know, Eagle the Living Planet and new characters and new places that we can go. But 
overall, this trailer, this trailer looks awesome. I can't wait, wait to watch it again. And I can't wait to hear what you guys think about it. What do you guys think about the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 trailer? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Um, please let me know in the comment sections below. And also, also if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you like hearing me talk about movies or trailers, um, please hit that subscribe button and come join the conversation. I'll be glad to have you. With all that being said, I'm Darren Lizzie Jr. I hope you enjoyed this review, and I'll catch you guys next time.